Hi, it's Sonia Fox, Web Technology Specialist with Egg Communication at NDSU. Wanted to share with you, um, if you ever need to change the case of text in a Word document, there's a really easy way to do it. Recently, I came across somebody who's editing a newsletter, and she was able to uh, create a table of contents based on headings within that Word document that set off each story in her newsletter. However, in her table of con uh, contents on the first page of her newsletter, she didn't want those headings to be in all caps, even though within the document they were all caps. So there's an easy way to do that in Microsoft Word. And what you can do, um, note that I am on the home tab of Microsoft Word. It's right next to the blue file tab. You'll want to be on the home tab where a lot of the editing options are. So if you go over to this icon, uh, it's a few over from the font size and type. You'll see there's a little a and a small a. There's a little arrow next to it. And here is where you can change the case. So uh, note here in this Word document, I have uh, some text that is in all caps, and instead of me having to retype that all in the appropriate case, what I can do is click on that Change Case option, and I'm going to change it to Sentence Case, because in the example that I had talked about in uh, for that newsletter table of contents, uh, we were able to change the case. Um, starting the sentence off with a capital letter and just making the rest of it a lowercase. There's also other options. You can also choose um, to have everything in lowercase if you didn't want to capitalize uh, the first word in your phrase. Um, you can go back to uppercase. Uh, there's also uh, capitalizing each word. So sometimes this might work out to um, if that's an editing style that you have. So if you have any questions about changing the case in a Word document, please feel free to contact myself.